Welcome to Tech Express. Today tutorial, let's talk about connecting your hosting domain into Workspace. Integrating your custom domain with Google Workspace is a game changer, especially if you're looking to enhance your professional communication and productivity to host. Whether you're a business owner, freelancer, or managing a personal project, uh, let's get started. The benefits of connecting the hosting domain into Workspace. Using a custom domain with Google Workspace elevates your professional presence and helps you build brand consistently across your communication platforms. So before we begin, ensure that you have an active domain with hosting and a Google Workspace account ready to set this up. So let's configure your hosting domain. Log in into hosting your account and go directly into your domain sections. Directly in here, you'll find a domain you want to connect to the Google Workspace. We'll be updating the DNS settings to link your domain to Google with services. So in this case, it would be actually this one. Now, let's get in the DNS information from the Google Workspace. Now head over to your Google Workspace dashboard. During the setup process, Google will provide DNS records that essentially to connect your domain. This usually include MX records for the email services and possible some TXT or CNAME records. In here, what I wanted to do is to choose Get Started if you don't have a Google Workspace account. I'm going to be choosing the name of my business, the region, my first, my last name, and the current address. In this case, yes, I won and I have a business domain name. Let's go back here and copy my domain, which in this case is this one. Copy it, paste it, next. Now use this domain to set up your account. Let's go into next. And here into the domain, let's say for example, administrator, you choose your passcode. I'm not a robot and agree to the continue. Once you are inside your administrator console, let's hit into domains and hit verify your domain. Now let's go into activate. And here are the DNS settings. Let's go into next, go to step number two. Now here you should see that we have the priority host record and the points too. So what you wanted to do is to go for type MX. Let's go back here into domains. Here into domains, I'm gonna hit into managed. Directly into managed, focus into DNS name servers. And here into the type, remember that we were looking for MX. Now let's go back, choose the host record, which is add point two. I copy this, the priority should be number one, and add your record. Lastly, I'm going to add the new record of the MX, of course. Go back, ready, retry, verify your domain into Google Workspace. Once you updated your DNS setting into hosting, you wanted to return to Google Workspace to verify your domain. This step is crucial to activate your Google Workspace services with your custom domain. Google will get you through this verification, which confirms the proper DNS setup. And as you can see, we can start by creating some new users. So I'm going to hit into create and here add your team email account, hit into done. And then you can start adding your people inside your uh, URL, your custom domain that was generated for you guys. So there you have it. You have successfully connected your hosting with domain to Google Workspace. Now you can enjoy the full suite of Google Workspace tools with a domain that reinforces your brand and professionalism. If you find this guide helpful, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe to Express for more digital solutions, have any questions or insight connecting the domain to Google Workspace. You can share your thoughts into the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. Best of luck with the Google Workspace integration. Stay tuned for more tech tips and tutorials from TechPress.